Hey guys, it's Ren from Makeup by Ren Ren, and if you want to see this look, my glam fall makeup tutorial, stay tuned for more. Hey guys, so I'm back with another fall tutorial. So this is the look that I came up with. I'm actually wearing this look to a MAC Pro class here in Atlanta, um, a drag makeup class. So I decided I could go a little bolder even though it's Sunday at 2.30 p.m. Um, so this is the look I came up with. I wanted to definitely do a deep lip um, as well as kind of coordinating berries on the face. And um, I like how it turned out. I actually used a lot of um, Makeup Forever and Bed Nye eyeshadows in this tutorial since I recently got those, which I'm loving. So, um, yeah, this is the look I came up with. Really glam, um, great for evenings, very fall, very holiday party. So, um, if you want to see how to do this look, stay tuned for the tutorial. So, let's go ahead and get started. This is a getting ready with me slash tutorial. I um, already have a little bit of makeup on, including Tarte Maracuja Foundation, um, MAC Pro Longwear Concealer, and my brows. Oh, and NYX um, Primer. That's my favorite one, the purple one. So, um, here are the brow products. Tarte, Brow Gel, and Pencil, my faves. And, oh, there's uh, the concealer I used. <laughs> so, on my eyes, I have my eyes primed with Tarte Primer. I'm testing that one out. So let's jump right into the makeup. So I'm using my Universal Blender from Sedona Lace with a bronzer, which I find to be really, really nice as, as a crease transition color, surprisingly. Um, so I'm just applying this above my crease. And then I'm gonna start darkening up. So I started with the lightest, and then I'm going to a uh, Makeup Forever reddish brown shade with a Revlon crease brush. And this is going into the crease to deepen it up. And I love these colors, like I love the um, warm brown tones. Now this is a L'Oreal Infallible shadow and I find it works best actually with my fingers because it's kind of a wet shadow. So I'm dotting it onto the lids and it's gonna give me some really nice sparkle. So um, along the way, this is me really doing my makeup. So here I am touching up my brows with my Sedona Lace brow brush. Now it's time to deepen up the eyes a bit more. This is another Makeup Forever shadow. Um, and I'm taking a really pointy crease brush and I'm really defining that crease. And I'm going all the way from the end, all the way to the inner corner. So then from there you can go ahead and re-blend and reapply. That's how makeup is. You just kind of go back and forth, back and forth until it looks good. So um, now I'm gonna define my um, I call it the inner pocket of the, of the outer V. I don't know if that makes any sense at all, but um, I defined that a little bit more. And now it's time for the highlight. I'm using a matte eggshell shade. That way it kind of balances out the shimmer on the lid. And then blendy, blendy, blendy a little bit more. So now I'm moving to the lower lash line. This is a Urban Decay brown pencil. And then in the waterline, I'm using a Milani Black. So let's go ahead and shade the lower lash line. I put some browns, the darker the brown goes um, closer to the waterline. And I'm just trying to give a smoky look. So now my favorite liquid liner, Revlon Color Stay Liquid Liner. This is just a thin um, winged out line just to give my lashes something to stick onto. So I'm curling those lashes that are practically non-existent. <laughs> now these are a Lash Domain False Lashes and actually um, they're pretty good. They're synthetic, but they look real and they're really really affordable So I'm gonna give you guys a coupon code, which is run run and if you go to lashdomain.com, You can get 10% off. So it's a really good site because like I said, it's very affordable You can get 10 pairs of lashes for under $10 and then you get my discount code. So here I am applying it This is a more of a wispy pair, which I always love and I use Revlon lash glue now I'm tight lining with my Milani pencil again, and then I'm using my individual lash color to kind of pinch my lashes together. Go ahead and reapply some liquid liner to blend those lashes in a little bit better. So now I'm going back to the face. I put a little bit more foundation to kind of clean up, and again, that's that Tarte foundation. And as you can see, my hair is miraculously out of the curler, so that's what it looks like when I put my hair in hot curlers. 
Now I'm highlighting with the YSL Touche Claw number two, which I use a lot. Just, I like to blend it in with my finger. I think it works be best um, and I don't remove as much product. So now I'm actually using a new product for me is, um, it's a MAC Pro Sculpting Cream. I actually have a video on it that I'm gonna load soon. And it's just like a dark cream contour color. So I'm using that on the perimeters and contours of my face. And now I'm gonna set everything with powder. This is a beauty blender that's dampened with water and Ben Nye Banana Powder. And then for the rest of the face, I used a MAC MSF Natural Medium Dark. I'm using the Steel Duo Fiber Brush so I get a light layer of powder. And then I'm contouring with a MAC Blunt Blush, my favorite, and an Eve Pearl Angled Brush. And this is going to look really good on top of that um, MAC Pro Sculpting Cream because it kind of sets it and adds a little more. Now this is one of the Tarte blushes from the Holiday Collection set that I featured a couple videos ago. Really pretty bright pink. Just kind of warms everything up. So now it's time for the Glam Lips. This is a really deep lip pencil called Night Moth from MAC which is so awesome. Like it just vamps up your lip. And then I'm using a new lip color for me. This is MAC Rebel. New to me, maybe familiar to some of you. It makes such a pretty combo. It's, it's kind of like a, a, um, a pinky red. And then um, the liner goes really well with it to vamp it up. And then I'm cleaning it up with some concealer and powder. And that is the final look. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Check out MakeitByRunRun.com. And that's it. Until next time, have a great night. Ciao, Bellas.